Welcome back to the Transport Bandits channel. I'm Cheryl. I'm Jeff or Mr. Dimples. And we have shocking news. Shocking. Jeff has just deleased from Synergy RV Transport. That's right, a deleased. We have nothing at all bad to say about Synergy. They have been a great company. The people have treated us there great, fantastically. We've in we've fact, done well. I mean, we have a good relationship with all the people in the office. In fact, Cheryl is still there. I am still on with Synergy yeah. as the motorized division. So don't forget to use her or Transport Bandits as a reference. And I am here to help you. If you put my name down on an application, you're going to Synergy. I'm still with Synergy. Call me. Use my name, Cheryl Arnold or Transport Bandits. It's all still good. Why have you deleased from Synergy? That's a tough question to answer, Cheryl. I loved Synergy. I loved all the people there. I'm telling you, it was a really difficult decision because I loved working at Synergy. But I had this amazing opportunity open up for me. And it was just too good to pass up. All of what they call the China dolls of the RV industry. Airstreams. Airstreams. And we're not ready to reveal the company just quite yet. No. Because it's kind of an, a, a limited driver company. Very limited. And it's a, it's a very... Um, a proud company to work for so we're yep. happy to come over to oh, this yeah. new company but we have to but start off as a complete yeah. underdog on I'm the bottom new. of the barrel oh, yeah. situation i got no pull there whatsoever no, so don't even ask us if you can get hired on with them you want to go where the transport bandits are going or anything we have no pull whatsoever this is such a small company they only have like 30 or 40 drivers so you know there's just not a lot of openings. Right. So there will be times in the future. We don't know when, but we'll reveal that company then because we don't want an on flux of people calling and say, I want to work there and all that because it's basically you have to kind of be maybe be recommended by a driver. You have to have no dings against your MVR. They only want like top tier drivers. You got to be um, recommended and. You know, almost somebody has to die before you can get on with them. Yeah. With that being said, we're not going to just be pulling airstreams. We've got an opportunity to pull boats. We may have an opportunity to pull, we'll be pulling other campers. Yep. We'll be pulling um, possibly horse trailers. So. Yeah, and whatever's on Central Dispatch. And Central Dispatch load board will become available to us, which is an amazing opportunity there. And we're really excited. I dropped my tow-away contract with Synergy, but I am still hired on as a motorized driver because Jeff will still be able to get a load um, from Indiana or Ohio or somewhere and head wherever. And then I can look at Synergy and get a motorized and go that same route. And, and you exactly. still do just like we're doing now. Exactly. Um, you know, you guys are getting a little um, tired of watching us do the same old routes of going back and forth across 90 and 94 to British Columbia and Alberta. And while we love going to British Columbia and Alberta, that's one of our favorite routes, um, we would like the opportunity to take you to San Antonio Riverwalk, the Grand Canyon, uh, the Florida Everglades. Um, in different Key places, West. yeah, the, the different places around the country, and this opportunity will allow us, not that Synergy did, it's just we chose to go on the Canada runs. So because that's where the best That's runs. where our best money was at, but this will allow us to go all over the country at basically the same rate. Right. But, um, you know, I was getting tired of the cold. Yeah, we're, we're wanting to work our way into the warmer climes of the United States. As all of you already know, I hate pants. <laughs> and when it's cold, I have to wear them. Yeah, so maybe Jeff can just wear shorts for the rest of the year. Is that right? That's a good reason to change companies, right? Sure, good enough. <laughs> In any case, we're really excited um, to start kind of this new chapter in our RV transport life. And, I'm excited uh, yeah. and 
I'm a little apprehensive. And it's scary to leave Synergy because, you know, I knew everybody there so well. And the people at Synergy, uh, we had such a good relationship with them. We cannot say one bad word about the people in the office there at Synergy and how we were treated as drivers. As a great company, we just have, when you have a, a, a better opportunity open up, sometimes you have to open that door and step through, even though it means taking a big chance, a big risk, starting all over from scratch, uh, helping your company out, you know, um, starting as the low dog in the totem pole kind of thing. Yeah, it, it is. It's scary when an opportunity opens up to walk through that door because you don't know what's on the other side. You know? Exactly. And, you know, if it don't work out, I can go back on my hands and knees and big synergy for my lease back. <laughs> no, we left on very good terms. And Jeff and myself as a, t as a team driver on the towway division are welcomed back there at any time. So we have a very, still standing, very good relationship with Synergy RV Transport. Um, but that is the shocking news. We have deleased from Synergy. I'm still on motorized, but Jeff has a completely deleased the truck from Synergy. And um, now we're gonna try this whole new running around the country with different items. And you guys are gonna follow us, right? Yep. Because we're going to go to a whole bunch of new, fun, crazy places, so. Yeah, with the Airstream, I get better rates per mile and better fuel mileage. That equals more money in my pocket. Exactly. And ha getting better fuel mileage with Airstream, because the air just, like, goes over them, like, nothing's stopping them, and they're lightweight. Yeah, it's right in the name. Airstream. Airstream. Yes, but we do. There is a lot more involved with taking care of these units. I mean, we have to be very much on our P's and Q's, watching tree branches. You know, no gravel roads. Um, making sure that they are all very carefully taken care of. From There's point more eight paperwork. To point eight. There's a little more paperwork, a little more minutia involved in all of this. You but, know, Cheryl, you've used that word several times, minutia. 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 I don't understand that word. Minutia. I don't even think I like that word. Minutia. In fact, I may forbid you from ever using it again. Forbid me? Who does he think he is? You think you can forbid me from doing anything? You I guys know better than that, hey, right? <laughs> hey, I forbid you from using the word armoire. Armoire. And you don't armoire. use it no more. <laughs> I do that out of respect for you. I don't need to use the word armoire. I told you not to use the word for your. Foyer. Yeah, and you don't use that no more. Either. It's out in the foyer, right? And I told you the not foyer, to refer. That little room in front of the living room. Yeah, between and I told the door you the not living. to refer to that color as houndstooth. Houndstooth doesn't like the word houndstooth either. So, and I'm not telling you what word I don't like. Some of you know, some of you don't, you know. But we're not going to use that word. Can I tell? No, you cannot. Because I hate that word. Don't say that word. Moist. Jeff! <laughs> All right, that's enough that we're just going out on a limb now talking about words that we don't like. Okay, this company, there's a little more minutia, whatever <laughs> that means. That just means that in this company, there's a lot more nitpicky um, little paperwork type things to do that I will have to relearn and go all back over a little more paperwork, a little more care, a little more things that we have to take care of than we normally have done in the past with Synergy. So, but we're excited. You excited? Oh, I'm stoked. Show them those stoked. pearly white teeth. There they are. Yep, I'm excited. I love his new Mexican teeth. Let's see those teeth one more time. Yay, pretty smile. Smile for the camera. You don't look near as mean and mad all the time now. He's going to smile every chance he gets. Look at that smile. Let's show him your dimples, Mr. Dimples. There's those dimples. Right there. <laughs> Are you still going to look mean like you're going to murder somebody at any moment? Well, I have to look mean when I tell people to subscribe. <laughs> Yes, please subscribe to our channel because this is going to be a whole new, I wouldn't say a new, a new chapter. 
we're still in RV transport. So you guys are going to come with us. We've got new places we're going to be going, new places we can show you. We are still the Transport Bandits, and you guys are going to like and comment down below. What do you think? So Jeff has the least from Synergy, with a heavy heart, of course, but we are excited for this new endeavor, and you guys are going to come with us. You're going to like and comment down below. What do you think? And we might even show you a little bit of footage from our first adventure. Coming oh, up. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright, that's all for us. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned to the Transport Bandits because it's going to be even more exciting, more fun, and more of the fun side of RV transport with the Transport Bandits. Thank you for watching. Transport, transport Bandits, bandits. out!